Hey guys, so this video might be a little out of order. This video might be all over the place. The reason why I haven't been vlogging or recording myself at all while I was here up until now is because it is beyond busy at the parks. Like it is just absolutely absurdly busy. The parks are just incredibly overpacked and stuff. Point where Minion Mayhem, a fucking Minions ride, my guy, it was like an hour long. He wrote it because it's something simple, but it's just, it's so crowded in there and it's so loud. Now vlogging out in public, it takes a lot out of me. Uh, being able to just pull up my phone and record myself talking people staring at me like I'm a fucking weirdo. I just want to give you a heads up that this is going to be the start of the vlog. We went there, we explored Universal for a bit, we went on a couple of simple rides like Men in Black, and like I said earlier, the Minions ride. Nothing really happened, we just grabbed lunch. I got my lanyard, which is pretty fucking awesome. It's backwards, of course, it's like a Harry Potter thing, because I'm a huge Harry Potter nerd. So I get this thing started on the right note. We drove from where I live to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, to go pick up my brother's girlfriend. And then after that, we drove down to the Pittsburgh airport, and then we went on a two hour long flight. And then we, we checked in last night at like 10 o'clock at night, and then I, I basically passed out. And then we went to the parks today, but we haven't really gone on any major rides. Um, I'm not really gonna be recording myself that much today. I will be recording my reaction after going on the Velocicoaster, if we can go on it, because right now I keep saying it's closed, and then it's like a two hour long wait. And I don't know if it's gonna be open today. Hopefully later tonight it's gonna be open. And if not, we're gonna do it tomorrow. If not tomorrow, then Monday. I'm gonna write it. I don't care if it takes five hours of wait time, but we're gonna be writing it. And I wanna get my honest reaction of it afterwards because I can't bring it on and I can't record myself while I'm on it. I haven't been here in like years and I'm gonna go back here. I'm gonna come back here with my good friends later this year in the summer. So I'm just kind of practicing the whole vlogging thing and recording myself thing because it's a big deal for me. And I'm gonna start heading out that stuff. Hi there. So I am heading back to the resort. Wow, that lady is shit. And I'm walking back because I know bitch. Anyways, there were people that I was gonna cross paths into and they looked really fucking weird. So it is 2.15 in the evening. I didn't record anything really at the parks because it is ridiculously busy. I'm heading back to the resort now because wait for it. These motherfucking shoes do not fit my, my motherfucking large clown looking feet. So we're heading back to go get an upgrade. So that way I do not die while I'm adventuring the islands of Adventure Park. I'll probably do more vlog type stuff um, tomorrow or Monday depending on the weather and whatnot because right now a lot of the big things are closed and it is just extremely fucking busy I mean you can barely hear me I bet inside the parks and just so stressful waving my fucking phone around but yeah we're about to approach the hotel right now at the resort once I get there I'll give people who don't know where I'm staying the Los Portofino Quick little gander, it's a very beautiful place. So we're about to approach the Portofino Bay. It's probably one of my favorite things. I just kind of want to show you. There's the canal by which you can take a boat to, directly to the parks. So I'm about to make it into the resort. Oh no, someone over there. <laughs> and I don't know how I, how I, how I missed this because I, I really shouldn't. But uh. Take a look at this. Don't miss. Mission failed successfully. Okay, so I just got back in my hotel room and I thought I'd give you just a little bit of a tour. I'm just gonna give you a little tour of where I'm staying um, for the three nights that I'm here. So uh, you come in here, you know, typical standard door. Go that or zoom there, you go. As soon as you walk in, you got a little coffee stuff if you are into coffee. We have these drawers. Drawers, what the hell am I talking about? This is a closet. Oh, there's extra blankets and stuff. That's so good, because I sleep on the pullout. So I did not even know that was even a fucking thing. That's awesome. Okay. I was wondering why the hell there was no blankets last night. And then you come into the first bathroom. You got a stand-in shower. It's pretty nice. 
Hello. Um, you know, typical stuff, you got like a makeup mirror. Hello again. <laughs> and then uh, just as a simple sink and bathroom, a nice little decoration. Um, again, very, very nice. This is basically my bathroom because, um, like I said, I get the pull-out sofa, which this is actually a sofa which pulled out into a bed. Um, yeah, I get this whole room. Um, nice little TV, nice little stand. Ignore that mess. These are the devil shoes that I was wearing that I'm going to switch out. And as we come out here, um, yeah. <laughs> My camera just doesn't do this any justice. It's just straight, it's just so beautiful out here. I mean, the water just looks so, I don't know, vibrant and clear at some points. But just like the view that we have, because we're in the fourth floor. So, I mean, look, there's the boat right over there. It's gonna come around when this one goes out. Every 15 minutes the boats come and then they take people um, to the parks, which are right over there. So this, this is the first room. Um, then they go over here. This is a separator for both doors. They both shut and make it pretty, pretty silent. This is the second bedroom. This is the main bedroom. This is where my brothers, my mom, and my brother's girlfriend are staying. Um, nice little TV. This little desk if you want to do some work. Two beds. Don't know the size. I think not queen. I think they're just twins or something. They share their beds. More luggage. And we'll get to this in a second. I want to get to the bathroom. So they actually have their own entrance that they can use. So we both have two sets of keys. Um, I actually haven't been in here before. I think it's the same. Um, they have a tub, which is different. Or mine's a stand on. They get two sinks instead of just one. Typical bathroom, generic picture, nothing crazy. Stand up a closet ordeal. Do they have a thing? I think that's what the one that my mom gave me. She gave me one of those things for my pull out. I did not realize the other room also had the same thing, so I get double the stuff. It's pretty cool. And then we walk over here. I'm out of breath because I just I walk like a half a mile. It's not locked. We actually have our own balcony, which is fing sweet. This. It is just something else. I mean, it's just so nice, it's so nice and beautiful out here. Right now in PA, which is where I live, it's like 20 degrees over here. It's 72. I mean, ooh, it's a, it's a steep drop. <laughs> That's where the boat is. That's the main entrance right over there. That's where the check-in and everything is. We're in the west wing. Um, over there is like kids' suites or whatever. There's like a minions room over there. Very, very expensive, but if you're into that and you have kids, you can do that too. Not really much else to talk about out here. Again, just something that you have to see to believe. It's just, or maybe you just believe me. It's just so fucking gorgeous. And this is the peak of the day. I think the prettiest part of this whole place is at night or sunset or sunrise, but we'll have to catch that tomorrow morning if I'm awake enough to do so. That's essentially the room tour, quick little thing. I need to get back to the parks. It's so weird that I can't like manually flip it. Like if I wasn't doing like from this angle and I was just doing it like outward words, I can't think right now, I'm really tired. Um, I'd be able to flip it around on the spot, but I have to stop, cut, and then film again all right so you know how i said that i'm just gonna try and this manually Ugh. these shoes all right these are these are the devil shoes these things don't fit they're too small they've been cramping my feet i walked about three miles at the park at the first park at universal studios today and you know what i'm about to switch out to ready for this ready for this there it is baby look at that look at these baddies i'm gonna go to the park and i'm gonna look like an absolute Chad with these on. Apps, look, look, at, look, look at those. <laughs> um, honestly, I'm still kind of getting used to this whole videotape thing. I'm very self-conscious about fit, like videotaping myself. I've been wanting to do travel stuff and just to kind of like record our adventures and stuff. It's really hard, you know, when you're really self-conscious about how you look and how you feel. People staring at you all the time because people look at you weird because you're holding a camera and talking to nobody. But yeah, I, I got my Crocs on. I'm chilling. And I'm gonna start walking over. I'll see you next time.
Hey Ryan. What did you think of Ken the hat? Kind of scared me. Yeah? Yeah? Okay. Rate it out of 10. The 12 is the best ride they ever have. 12? Okay. Yeah, it's the best ride they ever have. You hear here for 12. So I just rode the Velocicoaster. Holy fucking shit. It was fucking gnarly. We're about to enter Largo Land. Here's a look. 